Themeroller in Oracle Apex makes it easy to customize the appearance of your application. To get started, click on Themeroller from the Developer Toolbar. From the Themeroller dialog, you will see two tabs, Theme Style and Logo. Under Global Colors, I will see a number of accent colors for my application. For example, the header accent, body accent, link, and focus colors. Simply changing the header accent will update the UI immediately. For example, if I pick a red color, Notice that the header change and also the accent color applied to the side navigation. I'm going to update this to be a light blue or teal color. And as I do this, notice that the text and UI colors change uh, in real time. Now I can see that I've also updated the link color and focus outline simply by updating the header accent. Let's update the link color so it's a bit darker and easier to read. Now I can also navigate to other pages in my application. If I go to Tasks page, notice that the theme roller will open up again exactly where I left off. Here I'm going to change the navigation so it's a bit lighter. Click on the navigation header in the theme roller, and now I see a number of options. Under navigation style, I'll select light. I can also change the text color for the inactive items. If I go to body, I can see that currently the body text and body uh, background has a contrast of you know, 11. So it's very good contrast. What I'm going to do instead is just make this uh, just a bit lighter. And now I've made it too light, so it's a bit hard to see. And I get this warning by this color contrast checker saying that it passes for really large text, but otherwise not really. So let's update this to be just a bit darker. OK, very good. I can also update the active color so here, I can see the icon colors, and this is the active state and the normal state. And what I'd like to do is update the active state so that it mirrors the accent color. I can also enter a color value. So let's grab the color value for the accent on the left. I can click on this, copy, and then go back to the icon and simply paste my value in. And now you see the same colors apply. I can also change many other attributes of my application. For example, I can go to buttons and change all the button colors. I can go to forms. I can change the color palette that's used in my entire application. For example, in charts and other uh, components such as cards. I can also go to the layout and change the layout options, such as the height of my header, the width of my side navigation tree, and so on. Finally, there's a section for custom CSS where I can enter any CSS that I'd like, and that will be applied to my entire application. This looks pretty good to me, so I'm going to click on Save As and save my theme style. Let's call this My Company and click on Save. At this point, the theme style is saved, and I can simply apply this to my application by setting it as the current theme style. Let's also change the logo. Click on the Logo tab, and notice that the current logo is a text logo. I can update this text, and notice a change will show up immediately. But if I have an image logo, I can also use that. Simply select the type to image and drag and drop your image logo into that drop field. Save your changes, and that's it. Within just a few minutes, we are able to customize your application with a custom color scheme and change the logo without writing a single line of code. Thanks for watching.